June 13, 1863, in Vicksburg, and the Confederate stronghold of the Mississippi River is weakening. I'm Austin K. Etris. I'm captain of Company F of the Northwest 15th Arkansas Volunteer Infantry, raised up in Benton County, Arkansas, which is a northwestern county in that state. We were sent down here about a year ago, and we've since been placed in Green's Brigade of Bowen's Division in General Pemberton's Army of Mississippi. We came into Vicksburg on May 17, 1863. We were uh, pushed back from our defenses at Big Black River. We're, since we bore the brigade's uh, hardest fighting, while we've been placed in a reserve position, the men are basically taking it easy, uh, trying to recoup their strength. We lost about half our men down at Big Black River, so they've kind of given us an easy job to do here in the past few weeks. We've been here about three weeks or so. I've been in this army since the war began when uh, the federal government decided that it was going to suppress the rights of the free citizens of Missouri and I decided that that weren't right and I went with Arkansas when it seceded and besides that all the boys was joining up and I didn't want to be left on the farm and miss out on all the fun so I joined up this big, great big army and got into this great big war. And sure enough, it did get bigger and it's gotten a lot worse, but we're suffering on hard times here. We're here holed up in Vicksburg and been here for 26 days and no hope is in sight except for maybe Johnston who's busting through, hopefully. And food's getting pretty bad, but real military tradition runs in my family. My great uncle fought in the Creek War and my great granddaddy fought in the Revolution. And It'd be kind of a disgrace to the family to run out on it and duck out, and some of the boys have done, so I figure I'll just stay here with General Pemberton and stay here to Vicksburg until we're relieved or whatever happens, it's, it's all in God's hands. Um, General Pemberton and I figured, though, that if it worse gets to worse and the Army tries to break out, we'll be in there on the fight to get out of here. Yeah, sure. But Times are hard with the day and night artillery bombardments. But, well, we got our music. It breaks the monotony. It gets us away from the daily routine. It reminds you of Arkansas. It's our home. And it kind of sets the mood in there right, where everybody can sleep better. Lee Paul Chuck, TV8 News, Vicksburg, Mississippi.